guys and welcome to my channel my name is Sonia for those of you that are brand new today I am participating in a challenge hosted by the Latina next door Yami from little Latina next door and Christina from Christina K um, the challenge is today the look for less challenge which is a challenge that Yami hosts every month with the different co-host so for this challenge I had picked out I'll insert a picture uh, I have seen this vase at HomeSense and it was $30. So I thought I can recreate this for a lot less and mine cost me $8. So here are the materials and the process how I made it. For this project you will need a vase. A clear coat so nail polish clear coat I am using Sally handsome hard as nails from Dollar Tree I just had this on hand um, actually it's from Dollarama and it was a dollar this was also from Dollarama at 350 then I'm using um, this peony that came from Dollarama at three dollars. The rest of these were dollar fifty, so I'm using this one, this one. This is almost like um, I want to say like oregano. This one, and you'll also need a pair of scissors. So first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this rope and the sticker. I'm thinking I might reuse this for something. So I'm going to reuse this rope as well. And now I just have to figure out how I'm going to take this stuff off. So I tried washing it and it didn't work, so I'm going to use a nail polish. Well, that worked like a charm. So to give it that look that it contains water, I will be using the nail polish, but I'm going to actually use painter's tape just to get a straight line. I'm going to do about an inch. And I'm just going to mark off that inch just so I kind of get, don't go too out of line. doesn't have to be perfect, but you don't want it to be uh, too out of whack either. And you want to apply a generous amount. Let that dry and see if it needs a second coat. While that's drying, I'm going to prep my flowers.
gonna do one more coat with the nail polish. You can see the it's glossier at the bottom so it kind of gives you almost the illusion like there is water in it I'm gonna let this dry and then I'll show you how it looks in my home here is the piece all finished I know that I have used the peony instead of hydrangea like on the picture I just couldn't find the hydrangea if I would have found it, I would totally use it here, but um, this has turned out really nice. And I don't know if the camera will do its justice, but there's the, the blurry line that kind of makes it look like there's water in it that I did with the nail polish. And just a correction, I have said that the Easter twigs, like these one and these, were $1.25, but looking at the receipt, the Easter flowers were actually 50 cents. So even better. So the total cost was $8, plus the little bit of nail polish that I have used, which I already had on hand, but if I were to count that in, it would be a dollar. So $9 versus $30 that it was at Marshall's. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're brand new to my channel, first time visiting, I would love for you to press that subscribe button and a notifi notification bell and stick around and see what my channel is all about. So thank you so much for watching and I will have all the playlists, Yami's channel and Christina's channel post, um, posted down below in the description box. So make sure you watch all the channels participating in this fun challenge. Thanks so much for watching.